Hey guys, so today I showed you how you can install the third official of Samsung ROM uh, that is running on Android 4.0.3 for the Samsung Galaxy S2. Now, we got the new leak today, so I just made a video on the uh, the third leak, the XXKPA that uh, Mobile leaked for us, um, and how you can go ahead and install it and all of those goodies. Uh, but right now, there is a new one out, and that one is being called uh, XXLP1. Now, what seems to be new in that is that they come with the new task manager that you will see when you hold in you know the multitasking thing so you see a task manager like down here and also face unlock seems to be better improved and also some you know bug fixes and stuff like that so I'm just gonna go ahead and check out that and try it out pretty quick here so what I'm just gonna go ahead and do is install it using Odin kind of the same way as I did with the other one if you want to go ahead and download this new firmware XXLP1 uh, then I will leave it in the description below um, so yeah, that's kind of sweet. Okay, so I'm just going to turn off here and go into download mode. Connect it. Okay, now what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to quickly go over to Odin. Just going to open up Odin over here. And then what I'm just going to quickly do here is I'm going to select the PDA. Uh, the PDA is going to be, let's see here if we can go ahead and go back. The PDA, let's see here, XX. LP1 there we have it so the PDA of course is gonna be the code the phone is gonna be the modem and then the CSC file is gonna be the CSC file um, so very simple I don't think we're gonna make a repartition right now when we don't use the PID file um, so yeah and then we're gonna make this a second time uh, flash it again just using the, P the kernel uh, on the PDA and the Deselect phone and CSC. Hit start. It will do some stuff in the background, of course, as always. No. I'm just playing around here. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So yeah. Because you know, it's it's worrying to wait.
Now we're just gonna wait here until it will say finished. Or removed. There we go, it's removed. Now we're just gonna go back inside. Let's just disconnect it again because I need to go back inside. Oh yeah, badass. Now Let's just go ahead and deselect the PDA in the phone and uh, change the PDA to kernel. Yes, so deselect phone CSC. Yeah, and then go. And it will hopefully do the final stuff. Maybe we should go into Clockwork mod as well. But I'm too lazy to do that right now. To wipe the data and stuff.